So when it comes to media buying, media buying isn't hard, right? People just tend to overcomplicate it or they don't even know what the hell they're doing, right? So when it comes to media buying, specifically for an ads channel, let's say a TikTok, right? You want to break it up into three stages, right? The first stage is where your audience testing. So you might test broad interests, suggested targeting, right? These kind of three different app groups. And then you might put three to five creatives in the ad group that are identically the same, right? This, they might have a tweak in variations and some maybe small permutations, but the overall concept of the videos, the same, right? R let that run for, let's say two, three days. You look back at the data, see um, what is your, if you're optimizing for add to cart, what's that number? If you're optimizing for complete purchase, you make sure you wanna see at least a one-to-one -one ratio that you're breaking even on the front end, right? Then you take the winners from that stage one test, you move into stage two, to now you're split testing the actual creatives itself by individually testing each creative. So for example, you might have broad as a winner. You're going to have that borrowed ad group duplicated five times and you're going to have one creative in each ad group that's going to be completely different right now you move into stage three where you have the winners from audience and then you also have the winners from the creatives now you increase the budget by three to five x and now you're scaling those winners right and it's a rinse wash repeat cycle so keep it very very simple